All right, guys. Um, here I am at here another shopping center in East Brunswick. It's funny because it wasn't too far away from the video that I just recorded, and uh, there's like a couple of stores here. There's about like ten or eight stores here that are abandoned and boarded up. And uh, I'm gonna try to see if I could put up my phone on the window to see if I could see, give you a better look of things inside there. I have no idea what this is. This probably where the sign was, I can't even see what it says. I have no idea, but uh, maybe in the back they'll give me some uh, clue. So, ah, sucks. Broken glass here too. I don't know. I don't know if you can see anything in there, guys. Looks like the lights are still on. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know if you see that guys, but that's inside the building. Pretty kind of weird that they boarded up the building like this. Uh, yeah, looked like they broke into it. Somebody decided to board it up. All right, moving on, next store. Maybe I can get something here. Nah. Can't even give me a good look at this place. The only thing I could do is put my phone up to the window and give you what you get a good look that way. All right, so this store used to be Wah Salon and Spa. And they closed this one pretty good. They boarded it up pretty well. But here again, again give me a look this way so you guys see anything. Saw anything? I'm not risking myself to go on top of these doors or whatever. It's like it's impossible to go in the front. There's a bridal center, boutique. Okay, guys, I gotta do this again. It sucks that they board it up like this. I can't even like get a good view. What is this? Uh, it's a brick oven, pizzeria. It's Hollywood tan. It's a tanning salon. Oh, this is fucking high. I'm not gonna be able to reach that. Thank you guys. Really. <laughs> Let's 
Hey, hey guys, Hollywood hands. Look up. And this is soccer steam, probably a uh, store to buy soccer stuff. And by the way, guys, I love soccer. It's my favorite sport. Let's see if I could get a look into this place. <sighs> Once again, it's too high for me to see these boards. Maybe I could go on top of this cigarette stand looking thing. Oh, it looks like I see graffiti in there. It looks like some people broke into this place before and decided to board it up. I wonder why they boarded it up pretty well. Alright, so. The next store is a Carvel store. I guess this place, these stores are not making any business. So I decided to close it. Ah, uh, you can see here, there's a Carvel sign. Yeah, this place is a mess. I don't know what they'll do here, but it looks like they're probably going to demolish it. This whole shopping center, they're probably going to demolish it, that's what I'm thinking. I'm not too sure when this uh, area closed down, shopping center. I don't know if they closed all together. This looks like an everything 50 cent store. It's kind of similar to a dollar store. They're not really helping me with this. And what is this store right here? Ah, right, so this is, uh... Oh, this is, um... I think this is Pearl Vision? Or, uh, that gla eyeglass store, maybe? I'm not too sure actually. I'm not really too sure. Let me see if I can get a look into this place. This for me is like pretty amazing to see the amount of stores that are abandoned and closed down. I could see better looking to here. Uh, yeah. yeah, pretty crappy inside guys. This glare isn't helping. Yeah, here we go. Okay, the next store is let's look a little bigger. I wonder what this store was. Oh, <laughs> they broke into this place pretty badly. What is this store? I have no clue. Here's a view if I can get one. 
God, you don't even know what you're doing. Put this fucking balls here. Ugh. God damn it. It would be great if I had a chair. Can I like bend this down and get a view? Oh wait. Here's a view. So I guess this is Office Max. As you can see here, it says Ma Office and then Max. I don't know if you guys see that. Yeah, it looks like it says Office Max. All right. I think here's a better look at this place here. So I can see what it looked like. Whoa, it's close. Yeah, they, sh they broke the glass and everything. Yeah. Office Max is, you know, just like a staple store. A lot of broken glass here, guys. There's another abandoned store that we'll get to in a minute. There's another one. 18 Markers Market. You know what? Let me first go to the back of this entire uh, building. And then I'm gonna hit up this place. Check that, check what this is. I'm not too sure when this place closed down because I'm not from around the area. If uh, if you guys know when this place closed down, you just hit up a comment below. The sprinkle room and a fire door for Office Max. <clears throat> Set. They had some parking space here as well. More graffiti. <clears throat> They boarded the door up here. Here's a tractor trailer, some tires on the bottom. Wow. 
man. So it was Pearl Vision. I was right. I need these doors open, by the way. There's Party City loading them all. So that was a Party City. Maybe it was Carvel together. I don't know. Maybe it used to be a Party City and turned into a Carvel. See the door right here. Yeah, it's pretty locked up. there. Alright. Oh, here's a door that's open. I'm not even sure if I want to go in there. When you see a door open like that, <laughs> definitely abandoned. Looking out for myself. Costume jewelry. <laughs> Carvel door. Here's a door that's open. Which one is this? Oh, this is a soccer stadium door. And it's sad. The store probably was uh, once, um, making business but not anymore sad to see the graffiti that's going on around here there's an acne shopping cart <sighs> I want to I don't want to go too far because uh, I don't want to get sick and risk myself so This is a uh, Satori. Look at that. This was probably used to be Satori. Not even open. This is Hollywood Tans. Look how rusty and old this uh, stepway is. Is this still be able to be open? <laughs> the doorbell doesn't work. This is probably the longest video I made so far of recording abandoned stores. Yes, this is a pizzeria. Mario's. Yeah, it's pretty close. Era by Realty. Used to be Weight Watcher store. Yeah, pretty closed up. And now we're gonna go to other stores here. Let's see. Ah. Yeah, closed up pretty good. I think we're coming towards the end. Of this building. 
Oh, here is well, it says Cars Appliance, so this probably was, it used to be called Cars Appliance. There you go. So, this is the shopping center's uh, stores. Lost, Salon Spa, Bridal Center, Boutique, Carvel, Costume, Jewelry, 50 Cent Store, Martial Arts, Bravo, Falafel, and the other stores that I showed you. But, uh, <clears throat> but it looks like over here it's available for commercial brokerage, Lance Print. Here's another look. Stores. Alright, All right, I'm gonna hit up these two other stores here, see what they are. And I think I'm pretty sure there's more abandoned stores around here, which I might find. So I'm wondering what this store is. Oh, I think it's Office Depot. This one is super natural market. And guys, if you know where, uh, when the shopper center closed down, just uh, hit up a comment below to give me a better idea. These stores look like they've been closed down probably 10 years ago, the way I'm looking at it. Here's an available space. This one's still available. Yeah, this is definitely Office Depot. So, I guess it was a kind of a decent sized office depot. It's not the biggest one. I think I've seen bigger than this. <laughs> I've never seen a shopping center so full of abandoned stores like this. It's crazy. Uh, yeah, this is pretty good to done. At least it's not dirty like the other ones. towards the uh, shipping and receiving this store. I'm gonna check out this place too. And then that ends it for this uh, shopping center. Wait a minute, there's a sign here that says Gap. So, Gap used to be here. I gotta check out the sign in a sec. I wanna see this. Uh, by the way guys, here's shipping and receiving. The office, depot. 
only one dock door and there's an exit door in here. Well, as you can see here, guys. Yeah, it's up for realty. Hollywood Tans, Blue Ribbon Dessert Shop, Pearl Vision that's faded out, Carvel, and Gap. So Gap was here probably a long time ago. The bar, Salon Spa. Yeah. I didn't even know if this place is abandoned too. But you know what? Let me check this out maybe. Second. I walk. I walk across in a minute. Let me check this out. Supernatural market. So uh, I think this is a farmer's market. <coughs> Maybe that's another abandoned store over there that I just showed you a second ago. Says. Always, already rusting. Yeah, it looks like it's in bad shape. All right, so let's see if we get a look into this place. I don't know if I even can. I don't know, guys. They boarded it up pretty well. Oh wait, here's something. Let's see this. There's a spider there. Uh, I don't wanna, I don't wanna get in there. Put my phone in there because there's a spider in there. Alright guys, I'm gonna head towards maybe another abandoned building here. And the video is almost already 30 minutes long. Like I said, this is the longest video I record. Oh wait. Here's the view of the place maybe which I can get. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> oh shit, there's a cat in there. Is it? Hi, kitty. How are you? Oh, this is creepy. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Yeah. Okay. That was creepy. I wasn't expecting a cat like that over <laughs> there. All right. I actually wasn't freaked out when I saw the cat, but uh. I saw a person in there, oh, forget about it. That would creep me out. I'd be scared. All right, so I wanna to check to see this building. I don't know what it is, if it's closed down, abandoned. Now I'm just gonna go back and uh, drive around Route 18 to see more places. Look, another hot day, it's in the 80s. And yesterday, I went down the shore with my best friend. First time I caught a fish down the shore ever. I caught a summer flounder. So it was not big enough for me to keep. It looked like it was 10 inches. It has to be 18 inches. So at least it was something. I wanna check this out. Yeah. So yeah, it looks like it's uh, a closed down store. I'll find out what this is. Oh, 
it's it's a sushi store sushi buffet oh wait, wait. that that is open it's not part of that i don't know what this is though oh it's k and g this closed i don't even know one There's some product in there. Sorry about the brightening of this video. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. There we go. This, this used to be KNG. I think I know what store this was. Man, there's a lot of abandoned stores here in East Brunswick. Check the back for a second and then I'm gonna end it for this video. The door might have been shipping and receiving, I don't know. Most likely you'll see it in the back of the stores. Another door. Oh wait, this is the sushi uh, buffet. I'm not gonna get into there. <laughs> All right guys, that's it for this video. I'm gonna head towards my car now and check out some places, some more places on Route 18. Hopefully I can find some more before it gets dark. I'm not sure what time it is now. Maybe it's six something, so. <sighs> yeah, but this is a uh, quite interesting place here. This is like the first shopping center that's like totally abandoned, which I ever saw. So I don't know like if these stores are ever gonna be made into a different store or not but some of these stores are like in pretty bad shape I'm just thinking they're gonna demolish and tear it down but this one right here is probably gonna stay alive they're gonna probably put something there it's not in bad shape inside the one over here is probably not in bad shape, the Kanji. So, um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go towards my car now. Yeah, like I said, hopefully I can find some more places that are abandoned. <clears throat> so... All right, guys, uh, I'll catch you up in a minute. Hopefully I'll find something later.